today's episode of St. Paul's Trivia Challenge. Today I'm with... Jenna Langenbach, Isaac Langenbach. And we have some exciting trivia action, so let's jump right into it. Okay, in today's reading, how many total bridesmaids were prepared to meet the groom? Ten. That's right! Good job! <laughs> Next question. What happened to the bridesmaids while they were waiting to meet the groom? Sleeping? That's right! Yay! Okay, next question. How many bridesmaids went out to find more oil for their lamps? Five. That's right! Next, next one. Did those bridesmaids share the oil with the other ones who ran out? No. That's right. Here we have someone sweeping the board today. Last question. Did the bridegroom let in the unprepared bridesmaids? No. That's right. <laughs> How did you do so well today? Because I listened to God. And? The Bible. Did you hear this story before? Yes. Did you prepare? Yes. How did you prepare? By going over it? Yeah. Did you prepare, Jenna? <laughs> no. <laughs> In the game Jenna and Isaac play, we heard the story that Jesus shared from Matthew chapter 25, verses 1 through 13. This is a story about ten bridesmaids, one bridegroom, some lamps, and lamp oil. As you probably picked up from the game show, all ten bridesmaids took ten lamps as they were going to wait outside for the bridegroom to come out. But only five wise bridesmaids took extra lamp oil with them. All ten bridesmaids fell asleep, and as they were sleeping, the lamp oil ran out. They were wakened from their sleep by somebody shouting, Look, here comes the bridegroom! The moment they'd been waiting for! Luckily, the five wise bridesmaids had extra oil to relight their lamps. Hmm, but the other five foolish bridesmaids did not have any extra oil, so they had to go buy some. And while they were gone, the bridegroom came out, took the wise bridesmaids into the party, into the wedding, and they all had a great time. The foolish bridesmaids came back, and they were not allowed in. They were too late. Jesus told this story to teach the importance of being prepared. It is important to be prepared for when something unexpected happens. Having an umbrella in case it rains, or a flashlight in case the lights go out. In the story Jesus told, the bridegroom is Jesus, and we are the bridesmaids. One day, we are going to get to meet Jesus, and we have to be prepared because we don't know when that's going to be. We don't need a lamp and oil, but we do need to be prepared and ready. Each day, we have opportunities to share God's love and to spread his word, and we need to continue to love each other as Jesus loves us and have Jesus in our heart. Have a great week, everybody.